It's time for the EP Sports Network Post Game Show. And we are back here with the final three games to one for the Andres Eagles. I am Asa Costa alongside Haley Montoya. We are joined by head coach Loreno Gonzalez from the Andres Eagles. Coach, what a game. What yes. a game. What a game. Yes. Uh, Canatillo came out uh, strong in that first set. Uh, what did you tell your team, you know, after that first set to get them prepared? I told them this is the game that we needed. Our goal right now is to make it to playoffs. And this is an important game for us to take. Um, to, to try to get us and, and get us in that four spot. Uh, Andrews hasn't been in playoffs for a long time. And our goal, and with this squad that we have, I, I strongly feel that we can get that fourth place. If not higher, would even be greater, but we're trying to get that fourth place. Fourth place. Yeah, definitely, you can see it out there. Your girls, amazing players, great Thank players. You. Thank you. You can definitely see their chemistry. That's one thing, I'm a coach as well, and that's one thing I tell my girls, like, the chemistry is not there. You There's gonna, figure something yeah, out. yeah, of course. Yeah. So I wanted to ask. Obviously, you guys lost the first one, but came back for the next three. Was there anything that you kept reiterating to them as they? For me, it would be take that energy from this game to the next one. What What do you tell your girls? One of our first things that uh, we have an amazing track coach, Coach Essie. So I need to give her a shout out. Mm -hmm. She gave us a, a little thing that talked about word and about our negativity. Because sometimes you know how negativity kind of just uh, one person mm -hmm. and it just kind of crumbles everybody Domino else. Domino effect. Yes. Yeah, so mm -hmm. uh, one of the things that she did with us was to make sure that we think of our positive word. And I have them written down on my notebook. So one of the things that our captain, uh, Leslie Mojica, always says is like, hey, think of your word, think of your word. And I always think, think of our word and then our goals. Try to get to five first, 10, 15, 20. If it's not there, then we're trying to go for that next goal. So that's yeah. something I, I talk about. Yes, we yeah, want to bring it, in that chemistry, it. but that's yeah. something else that we, we, yeah. we try to alliterate on it. Awesome. Now going back to your captain, Mojica, her play today, she had some powerful, powerful hits there. Uh, how proud of you of her? I'm, she's a beast. I'm, I'm just so excited for her, like, Things weren't going her way for a little bit, and, and she, she had a little bumpy road, and, and her frustration, you could tell, because she's, if you can't see, she's super competitive. Oh, you, um, you can. Yeah. She missed the serve, and she was like, dang, she missed yeah. the dig. It's like, it's okay, girl. Like, you're there, yes. stay in it. So, um, but her energy is just something that th we needed. And, and for her to make everybody accountable of what they're doing is, she's on it. Um, sometimes yeah. it comes out a little bit crazy and sometimes it goes over, like don't take it like that like you have to take listen to what she's telling you because she's telling you the right thing and, and they finally got that chemistry where they're like okay yeah we got it you know now I'm going back like you said how hard it was to you know keep the girls focused during intercession you know how, how proud of your, your team right now right now extremely proud of them we um we didn't have a setter we tried to go with leslie but we're like oh my gosh we, we need that outside hitter so I'm proud of our freshman, Abby. She uh, is our, our incoming freshman, true freshman, came in and she ran a 5-1 and she really stepped it up. Awesome, that, yeah. yeah. So that's, that helped us. Awesome, awesome. We are here with Coach Loreno Gonzalez of the Andrews Eagles who uh, knock off the Canatillo Eagles. When we come back, we'll talk to the stellar captain, Leslie Mojica. This is Tuesday Night Volleyball on the EP Sports Network. Thank you. Thank you. Lab Real Estate Solutions. We are El Paso's premier one-stop realty team Proudly concocting customized real estate solutions in our lab to fit your needs. Lab Real Estate Solutions. Welcome to Artie's Community Corner, a show dedicated to exploring all the great events and programs by nonprofit organizations from all around the world. Sit back and relax and join Artie and friends as they tell all about causes and ways that you can help out too. Artie's Community Corner airing on epsportsnetwork.com. And we are back here. This is Tuesday Night Volleyball on the EP Sports Network as the Andres Eagles knock off the Canatillo Eagles. We are here with the captain, Leslie Mojica. Leslie, what a game. It was a hard game, actually. 
Oh, I'm just going to adjust that mic here, right here. Go ahead and talk close right there. Um, going back and forth, you guys uh, were knocked off on set number one. What, what did you tell your team to help get back into this game? Um, before we played Chapin, which was really last week, we had a... We had a deep talk and we had an exercise that helped out our team and we all chose a word that we were going to say to each other throughout the game and I think uh, when we told each other just to remember the word, that's what we came off of. Awesome. So I, I am a coach and I want to know you as a captain on the court, how do you take that role as you being captain? Are you a senior? Yes, ma'am. So how do you keep that role as a captain when you feel frustrated? Do you do you feel you can lean on your teammates? Do they feel they can lean on you? I mean, it looks like, from my point of view, you guys can. But as a team captain on that court, off that court, how do you, how are you able to do that as a volleyball player and still keep you and your teammates at the same level? I feel like uh, we just talk to each other nice, and when we start turning our backs on each other, and that's when the whole game starts turning on us too. And as a captain, I have to uh, keep the leader, like the leader role. And I know that in the back of my head, when I start going down, the rest of the team will start going down. So I just have to keep the positive attitude and everybody else will keep the positive attitude. Now, how proud of, how proud of you of your teammates? You know, everybody stepping up as by the, uh, and the, the freshman side of your mental, you know, stepping in. There. Extremely proud, mainly for my freshman. She came, she already knew she was going to be on varsity. We all knew she was going to be on varsity, but she didn't know she was going to have to have a big role on varsity. So I'm extremely proud of her and our whole team. Um, since last year, we've really progressed. We okay. wish you well the rest of the season. This is uh, Leslie Mojica for the Andrews Eagles. When we come back, it will be final thoughts. This is Tuesday Night Volleyball on the EP Sports Network. Lab Real Estate Solutions. We are El Paso's premier one-stop realty team, proudly concocting customized real estate solutions in our lab to fit your needs. Lab Real Estate Solutions. And we're back here, myself, Asa Costa, alongside Haley Montoya and Mondo the Monster Medina. Canatillo falls to Andres Eagles, three, three sets to one here. Um, great game by both teams, Haley. It definitely was. In the beginning, I said which team is going to make um, the least amount of errors, and I think it came down to which team was going to be able to come back from their downfall when once they got down, which team was going to be able to hold each other accountable and keep each other up. Uh, Andrews keeping their playoffs hopes alive in District 15A. Like I said, every Tuesday we'll be broadcasting a volleyball game. Tomorrow is Wednesday, which means it's time for the Monster Medina Show. Join us live at 6 p.m. at the Mo Showtime Sports Grill, 2106 North Zaragoza Road. And remember, we also have Thursday night football and Friday night football airing on the EP Sports Network. So for myself, Haley and Monster Ace, and she hasn't named who the elephant is yet. To be uh, continued. To be continued. <laughs> this has been Tuesday Night Volleyball on the EP Sports Network. Thank you for watching. This has been a presentation by the El Paso Sports Network. Follow us at www.epsportsnetwork.com.